think that's the only thing they need.
told you any more about these relics, has he? I suppose it's need to know. That Mishrax knows. Spider, why are you using a secure channel? Did my father tell you to do so? Huh? Clever scribe. No more flattery? Well, Mishrax asked me to keep you at arm's length. Perhaps he doesn't want you mixing in with our unsavory business. Were those his exact words? Only a guess. Who can say? And after all, who am I to question the Kel? Hm. Spider? I will find out what's going on here.
Baron's fighter. I greet you in the light. Baron? <laughs> I haven't heard that in some time. Uh, what is it you want, Scribano? I have heard that you have a great interest in human cultures, and as such, have acquired many curiosities. Yeah. I had quite the collection before my unfortunate relocation. But this isn't why you hailed me. Get to the point. I have a question. Uh, of course you do. You and my father came from the House of Wolves, once known as the House of Gentle Weavers. I have very little record of that time. A first-hand account would be invaluable. Kel wouldn't like my speaking to you. Misrax Kel would understand. This is important to the history of House Light, of which you are a part. You don't know what your father is capable of, little scribe. What does that mean? <sighs> this conversation never happened. That went rather poorly. Spider, there are questions my father refuses to answer. Have you seen him act this way before? You two were friends once. Even if Misrax had friends back then, I wasn't among them. I couldn't possibly speak to his behavior. You're being evasive. Oh, evasive? I prefer to think of it as coy. Well then, your father was unpredictable. We could have had everything we wanted if he listened to me, but he always knew better. Huh. Look at him now. Cal of a house holed up inside the city. Picking over ruins, pretending he's content in the shadow of the great machine. We were offered scraps and we took them. Oh? Is that ingratitude, I hear? I do not call the truth ingratitude, but enough of who my father is. Who was he? I expected this from Spider, but not from you. I am simply performing my duties as Scribe of House Light. I will gather knowledge regardless of who would keep it from me. Rockis. I told you not to speak of this. Do I have to dock your tongue? Father! I apologize for the Kells' behavior. Apology accepted. I see now. You're afraid that Lido will take off those rose-colored glasses. <laughs> Such a delightful human phrase. <laughs> and what will she see when she looks at you then? Do not speak to my daughter again. Oh, don't worry about me. Though, I'm not the only one who remembers. Sooner or later, she'll learn the truth. But I'm sure it will all work out. After all, what is it you say? The light provides. there, Captain. Figured I'd better take over while Mithrax is preoccupied. I heard he's dealing with some family issues. From what I could gather, he tried to shut Ido out from all this pirate business. Might have lost his temper. Definitely lost face. Ah, poor Ido. What do they say? Never meet your heroes? 
Kind of tough when your hero's your dad. No surprise to me Mithrax has got some secrets. Everybody's got something that keeps him up at night. I'm sure they'll work it out. Folks have a way of putting aside the differences when the world's at stake. <laughs> Just look at me and Zavala. Or me and Ikora. Or me and... anybody, really. What catches your eye? Happy hunting out there. Guardian, as you prepare for your next voyage, know that I will continue to assist in the conflict against Aramis. I had words with Mizrax Gel concerning his recent behavior. He explained he wished to shelter me from the violence displayed by Aramis Gel's crews. I said one does not protect by forbidding exposure. There is no safety in ignorance. I told him plainly that I will not be sheltered. As the Guardian Credo states, devotion inspires bravery, bravery inspires sacrifice. The unspoken line that follows is why I will remain on the radio. Now, we must continue to pursue the relics Aramis seeks. Board your ship and let us begin. <laughs> 